Welcome! With Halloween upon us, pumpkin carving season is almost at a close. So today, I'd like to take a look at one of my favorite demonstrations. We're going to use not only one, but two chemical reactions to carve this pumpkin. The first reaction is going to be between solid calcium carbide and liquid water to produce acetylene gas. Now, this acetylene gas is what's known as a hydrocarbon meaning it's a molecule made up of only carbon and hydrogen atoms. In fact, its molecular formula is C2H2. Uh, hydrocarbons, when in the presence of oxygen and some source of ignition, like a spark, undergo combustion reactions to produce CO2 and H2O. These combustion reactions are highly exothermic events. So we're gonna harness the energy from our combustion reaction to carve this jack-o'-lantern. Let's get started. So like I said, the first reaction, we're gonna add some solid calcium carbide. So I'm gonna place that down into a little bit of water that's in the pumpkin. Now immediately, there's lots of fizzing and bubbling, which is a really good indicator that our first chemical reaction is well underway. We're gonna give it a moment to make sure we fill that pumpkin up with that acetylene gas that we need for our combustion reaction, the second one. Now that acetylene is gonna react with the oxygen in the air. Let me place the lid on here. Okay. The last thing we need for our combustion reaction is a spark. So one, two, three. Happy Halloween.